What's up guys, it's your Motivational Gamer and Shooting Star, Shooting Chip. <laughs> so, so, yeah, um, you just call me sh Shooting Chip. Shooting, alright, Shooting Chip. And, uh, okay, so I got a funny story, um, you know, because, you know, in the intro we were like, alright, we're about to go get revenge. So we went to the church and to do our thing, and when we got to the church, um, see what had happened was, um, we got there and I realized that the app that I was using on my phone to record the game footage wasn't really recording. So we had crushed the other gym and you know, real, real bad. And I was hoping you guys could see the revenge. Um, but unfortunately, I'm, I'm, it's my first day and I've never done this before, <laughs> apparently. So we had to find another gym. So we went up the street and found a gym. We're going to take out a revenge on them. It, it doesn't matter because they're both Team Valor and it's a Team Mystic for the win all day because we're on our quest to become Pokemon. We're on a quest to become Pokemon. Master! All right. Team Valor is red, baby. It's red. It's red. Team Valor is red. All right. So, so, so here we are. We're, we're at a new place. Um, it's, I think it's... it's we're at Renna Center right now. Renna Center is the Pokemon gym that's about to get crushed right now. And since the gym is about to get crushed. So, um, let's go ahead and crush this, this gym. Yeah. All right. So... Um, I told you guys I was going to teach you guys how to gym battle effectively. Um, so we're at this gym here. Um, they have an 841 Arcanine, a 1351 Lapras, and a 1387 Arcanine. Uh, so we should be good with our Lapras um, and some other stuff. Uh, typically, I mean, when you're going in, you want to make sure that your element, uh, you have element advantage. So uh, you can go online. Uh, you can look for some stuff to kind of see, uh, you know, what's strong against what, what you can use against what. And, and try to plan accordingly. Uh, fortunately for us um, in our city, everybody's using the same Pokemon. Um, as you guys can see here, uh, my 1747 Arcanine is, is currently controlling a gym. And then I have a 1041 Jolteon that's also controlling a gym at the moment. Um, so we're basically hosting the Team Mystic Takeover. So right now, um, you know, just looking at some of my uh, Pokemon, I mean, I'm kind of moving up slowly but surely. Now, the big thing, though, guys, is when you guys are holding a gym is to make sure that you guys don't use your strongest monsters. Um, I threw my Arcanine in there because I don't really like Arcanine, and I'm not going to use them at all, really. Um, but um, make sure you don't put your strongest monster because you're going to need your other monsters to battle. I don't recommend battling in the gym at all until you have over 1,000 CP. Once you have 1,000 CP, do whatever you want. Um, but until then, I mean, honestly, you're just wasting your resources, like your potions and all that stuff. I know you get a lot of them, but it's just a waste of time, and there's better XP. Now, granted, as you get better, um, you guys would have saw in the other other video that I did if I would have actually recorded the gay footage. But uh, after we beat a, a three-person gym, we got 758 uh, or 350 XP. So in double XP, it's uh, you know 700 XP a pop if you guys are crushing that gym over and over and over again. So anyway, let's go ahead and dive in. So I'm gonna go ahead and fix my lineup here. All right, I got a 1438 lapis. Yes, baby. Can you see me in the screen? Yes, I can see you. No. Can you see me in the screen? No. Don't like the like the <laughs> daddy. <laughs> okay, so so we're gonna change our lineup. Uh, when you get into the battle, I mean, you can pick whoever you want. Um, I typically like to lead with my weakest and then go with my strongest, right? So uh, we'll start with, with like a Pharaoh here. Oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. We'll start with Pharaoh here. We'll go with uh, Dodrio. You know, some 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 waste, you know, some monsters you don't care about, you know, to kind of strategically place yourself. I mean, because you can use up to six. Um, so then, you know, you just throw them in however you want, right? Um, and then, so by this point, if I, I should be at the boss by this time, um, but then if I'm not, then we got something wrong. So how this works is when you get into a battle, you just got to, you know, kind of click the screen. Um, you can basically, um, you know, s swipe to the right or to the left to dodge special attacks. Um, but you're basically, it's just a tap touch. That's, that's all that's going on. Uh, right now, I'm, I'm, you know, I don't really care about, you know, dodging. I'm just kind of like... Just kind of demolish this dude real quick <laughs> as we you get didn't in. Even lose any health. No, I did. I did. I, I lost a lot. Look, but uh, you know that's the big thing that you guys got to look at, and and this is going to be a big thing when you guys get into strategy uh, later on as the game advances. Um, when your special bar fills up, you can actually use special moves by Lapras. holding uh, the screen. Um, after Lapras just smashed me. 
Uh, but we're going to bring our Dodrio in here. Uh, and Dodrio's about to get crushed by Lapras, but, you know, whatever. 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 We don't care. We don't care. Because we're still going to win. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so, but in, in the occasion that you are getting crushed, um, you can definitely swap your Pokemon out um, at any time by pressing the arrow key in the bottom right-hand corner. Man, Lapras is messing me up. Lapras is messing me. Lapras is messing me up. Yo, L Lapras is messing me up. Yeah, now it's Lapras versus Lapras. Yeah, 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 my CP's higher than yours. What? Can you open my getaway? <laughs> Yeah, baby, we'll open it in a second. All right, so, you know, you get in, and again, this is just like basic combat mechanics. Now, when you guys are in a gym, once you guys control a gym, uh, which we'll talk about here in a second after I heal all my Pokemon here, uh, but once you guys uh, control a gym, uh, things change. Uh, you can continue to fight. However, the XP is not going to be as good, um, you know, as it would be if you guys were, um, you know, obviously fighting for a dominating uh, force on the team, essentially. Because of the simple fact that um, if you guys own a gym, you're basically training. But when you're training, you guys can, yes, uh, Abracadabra is OP. Uh, but when you guys are training, uh, you basically just are increasing the prestige of your gym. Bruh, did he, did he really just want HP? Seriously, though? Get out of here, bro. Get killed by horsey. Get killed by horsey. <laughs> but when you guys are, when you own the gym, you're just increasing your prestige. Now, as you guys saw, after I killed the Watermill gym, their gym dropped to level 2. You have to deplete that all the way for them to lose the gym and be effective in a gym battle. But as you guys saw, I got 350 XP. They lost 3,000 prestige. They dropped to level 2. If I drop them to level 1, so like at level 2, they can only use 2 Pokemon. At level 1, they can only use 1 Pokemon. And then after you continually beat them, which I'm about to do for, I gotta, we gotta do it for the tube. Do it for the tube. Uh, we gotta do, and it for, do it for me and do it for Jichan, shooting star, shooting chip. I got chip. crushed last time. Yes, you did get crushed, baby. But but I'm still really mad at them. I know, I know, I know, I I know. Tell them, tell them how mad you are, baby. Ah! <laughs> and so, uh, so right now we're just we're just bringing we're bringing our little our little Pokemon back to life here. We're just going to uh, heal them up here real quick. Use these hyper potions because I got a crap ton of them. And then we'll just continue to take the gems just so I can show you guys. And I'll just put a crap uh, Pokemon in there real quick um, so you guys can kind of see. Yes, baby. Look, the bag is standing up. Oh, is it? So the Dorito the Dorito bag is standing up. All right, so, um, all right, so now that my Pokemon are healed up. And this is why, again, like, uh, you know, for the most part, you guys aren't really going to be uh, taking on Pokemon gems uh, early on unless, you know, your team is strong enough to handle what's going on yes. all right so lapras versus lapras Lapalos. why is graveler in the lineup we'll take now why is golem in the lineup because golem is the man let's change it up a little bit we'll use some machoke oh, go we'll golem. get golem in there golem can roll and that's actually a yeah but he's a ground type so he's not very strong against water types put him in there we'll get some uh Save cadaver for the end just in case things go wrong. Put pincer back in, put lapras, put alakazam. There we go. Boom. Money in the bank. All right. So, again, so we're just going to continue depleting this just so you guys can see, uh, you know, what, what the gym battle process looks like. My is about to get crushed by lapras right now. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. He's about to get crushed. He's about to get crushed. This dude, this dude can't even see my choke. Um, surprisingly though he's not hitting macho very hard which is good um i need to evolve my macho into machamp but he's yeah he, er, next <laughs> lapras is just he's killing us yes lapras is destroying my dodrio dodio it's called the dodio dodio no do duo do duo <laughs> Do duo. Do duo. Do duo. Do duo. <laughs> All right. So again, so while I'm fighting though, let's say like if some Team Valor rejects were hanging out or sitting in the car somewhere, if they were continued to fight, um, you know, train at their gym, they could continually raise their prestige as I'm fighting. 
And as they're raising their prestige, um, as I'm fighting, it would basically replenish their HP. So if there was enough people training at the gym, they could basically keep the level up, which is which is why it can help to, um, you know, stay on top of the game or stay on top of whatever gym you want to control, especially when fighting for controlling territories, because it can make your life a little bit more easy um, and more simple when controlling the gym. So again, we're just going to crush this. After I beat this guy this time, he'll only be able to use uh, one Pokemon. Um, oh, damn. Oh, okay. All right. He, he just killed Labrys. He just killed Labrys. So now we're about to hit him with these. Oh, my God. All right. Okay. All right. Arcanine is mad. You saw that? He's angry. He's angry. He's angry. Mm. All right. So now he's dead. He's dead. So now we've reduced the gym to level one. Okay. So now same thing. I'm just going to go back in. Uh, we got Meowth hanging out over there. We're just going to continue to heal our Pokemon back up. Uh, cre crush, you know, get the drill. Oh, what's a purple potion? It's a pink potion. Pink potion? Yeah, it's a legendary potion, baby. A legendary yeah, potion? Yeah, legendary. All right. Get Alakazam back up. Get some of these hyper potions back on Lapras. Boom. Alakazam healed. Boom. All right. And now we'll just go back. Uh, and now we'll show you guys this. And then we'll take over the gym here. So, because all we got to fight now is, is, yeah. So, we'll just leave that lineup in there. And then we'll just go. Because it's just Arcanine now. It's just little Arcanine. Ain't anybody worried about no little Arcanine. So. No little Arcanine. Yeah, we ain't worried about no little Arcanine. Boom. Please open my Gatorade. You want them to open your Gatorade? Yeah. <laughs> open, open her Gatorade. Open it. Open her Gatorade. Open her Gatorade. If they don't. If they don't? If they don't. What's going to happen? Snowy's going to eat you. Snowy is going to eat you guys. Snowy's going to eat you guys if you don't. If you guys don't know who Snowy is, you better ask somebody. Okay, but so we just beat him. Now the gym is cleared out. I mean, it's super empty. We win. We're victorious. And now at this point, you can put in um, anybody you want. So right now we're throwing our Parasect because we ain't using them for nothing. Um, so now we you know, taking over the gym. And as you guys can see, like when you check your Pokemon, it'll show you who all your gym leaders are. Um, and if you guys can hold the gym for 20 hours, uh, the reset time is the same pretty much every day. Um, you guys can collect coins 10 coins per gym owned and or, or you know per participant that you left in the gym and 500 stardust so you can create a nice residual income especially if you have a team of people um that are all working together with you uh to run an effective can gym we, team and you get a nice residual income growlis only has one evolve form so, with that being said, guys, you guys saw it live on TMG TV, uh, where we basically kind of got revenge on Team Valor for, you know, that, that uh, beating that they gave us in Episode 2 uh, back then. So, hopefully this was able to help clear up some stuff for you guys in terms of what to do, uh, you know, in your gym battles and stuff like that. Uh, again, like, I don't recommend gym battles till after 1,000 CP, so at least you guys are ready uh, to at least engage in combat and do some things on your own. So, with that being said, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in to Episode 5. I think it's episode five. Episode five. Episode six. You sure it's six? I think it's five. I don't know. But thank you for joining us on a quest to become Pokemon. Pooties. <laughs> Pooties. <laughs> I thought we were becoming masters. Pooties. All right. So apparently we're becoming Pokemon Pooties. But all right, y'all. See y'all in the next episode. Peace. Plish. Plish. Plash. Plish.